keep filling it up with water the last little bit as I'm working out. Let's see what these fries are all about. Carbon up, freaking jack. Feeding time. Yo, welcome to feeding time. The big guy, right back. The return of the glitzy gladiator, as you kids like to say. The uh, drove across town. Uh, gonna go do a big workout here. Day two, back in the gym. Freaking jacked. I'm already, already just feeling the weight piling on. So I'm doing a little bit of a uh, carb meal here. A little bit. Uh, I mean, are they? Aren't they all? And uh, before I, I go do a, a big back session. Did arms yesterday, traps, and uh, four forearms, a bunch of hand grips. Not the forearms that the Jeffries and and uh, other negative marks are out there doing. The, um, anyways, ponchos. I'm came for their chili dogs. It's it looks big in the picture. That's <laughs> what she said. Um, in real life, though, it's not nearly as uh, as impressive. The uh, but I did get myself more information. I got three of these here, and uh, they got just three vegan chili dogs. I went ahead and threw an order of fries in there, piping hot. I got some napkins. Maybe I should grab that loser food tray just to be safe. Uh, son of a get that loser food tray down here can never be too safe eating a chili dog oh no that chili dog came open they gave me some ketchup in there too let's try one let's go ahead it's feeding time let's let's try one with a just straight up the old vegan chili dog hmm Oh wow, that was really great taste. I'll tell you what, that video when I was vegetarian, when I was doing the one cheat meal a week eating meat, I did that wiener schnitzel, ate like the 10 chili dogs. I was so sick after that. Just eating that junk. I can tell eating this, this isn't the same. Like, in, in a very good way. Like, it tastes great, but it doesn't feel like you're eating something that's going to, like, just completely destroying you in the inside. As far as making it, like, sick. Wow. Wow. I gotta tell you, ponchos, they got their 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 ducks in a row. Yo, these glitzy what's the what are they? Hot dogs called glitzies? I didn't know. Yo, these dogs be bussin', yo. Is that how the is that is that the terminology we're using these days, bruh? Bruh. I never even used the words when I was a kid. I just always kind of let the people do whatever. And I've always just kind of just been like this. Just like, oh, you use words because you think other people are using them that think they're cool? They all sound like a bunch of dumb shit, if you ask me. <laughs> Bro. I'm kidding, guys. I'm kidding. Or am I? <laughs> Put a little ketchup on this one. <clears throat> Bruh. Oh, yeah. Ketchup was a good call. Good call. Oh, man. There's so many great vegan spots here in Vegas.
really, they have to, if you watch Ryback TV here, which if you're watching this, clearly you do. I've given you so many options to come to when you come here. This vegan restaurant should be on their payroll. Right before I do this other one. This is the uh, Pump Plex City and 10 count creatine. I always drink that, sip it on the way to the gym, and keep filling it up with water the last little bit as I'm working out. See what these fries are all about. Carbon up, freaking jack. Ryback, how do you eat that food and stay in such great shape? Well, Marco, you see, I, I need a significant amount of calories to keep this amount of size on in pure jackness. Jackness. A uh, very nice woman reached out and uh, to have me for an Amazon Prime show. It's like, I don't know if it'll be, it would be for like season three, but it's on vegan and, and plant-based eating. And this season or the upcoming season, I think they just did doctors and they're doing athletes on this one. And they reached out to see if I wanted to do it. They would uh, fly me to LA. And I don't know how long the shoot was. I don't even, they just said it was in April. They gave the dates. I don't know how many days if I would even be able to do it. Instead that uh that you know come on and, and uh they pay that and uh limo to the shoe and back. And that was it. And I was actually really interested in doing it. But then they it doesn't pay anything. And I'm just thinking and I just told her, I go, thank you so much for the offer. I'm going to pass. And this happens with so many people. This is why I love the position that I'm in. And when you work for yourself, you control your fate. So Amazon Prime, right? This, this, So they're not struggling for money, right? Everyone on that show, from the, the from the filming, the directors, from the, the woman whose show it is, everybody's making money, right? Who's not making money? All the people they're going to use to actually be able to do the show. I'm not saying I don't know what, what a fair offer would be, but I, I just love, I just think I go, not even mad, just no thank you. But they'll find somebody that will want to do it for free. And that's my whole thing. Never sell yourself short. And that wasn't a knock. They just think they just, that's just the way business, they, people, they they take advantage of people that want to be on TV. Like, I don't give a shit about being on TV. I can just keep doing what I'm doing. I've already been on TV. It doesn't change your life. Like, it doesn't, it's not like some awakening. You're not enlightened. It's not Scientology where you can buy $100,000 of programming and be enlightened, bruh. And I just, she was very sweet. She got back and I didn't even, didn't even say anything about like, oh, I want money for it. It's not even being greedy. It's just that, oh, everybody else is going to make money and you want me to sp spend money to come there and to eat for a few days, right? Would have been hundreds of dollars. Cool. Just, and that's not like, it's just like, I love having, this is why I liked working for myself and creating my own fate. As a promoters, people, they take advantage of people all the time. Promise you the world, the opportunity. I make my own opportunities. I'll promote veganism on my own channel, suppressed or not. It's just the way. Well, and then some people will be like, oh my God, you're such an egomaniac. Well, how? Everybody else is making money. Get paid for your time and your work. Otherwise, I'll take that time and work and put it into my brand that I'm going to continue to keep making money at all hours of the day. Growth mindset, hungry mindset. It's not being ridiculous. It's not saying, I want 
a hundred thousand dollars to be a part of this. Like that's no, I'm not saying that. I'm just saying they'll compensate me for my time. The whole a little limo and a, a plane flight, like, oh thanks, you're gonna find me there, a chance I could die. <laughs> like that's how I look at it. I'm taking a risk for free. You need to take a risk for something. Throw a few grand at me or something. I don't know, Susie. Her eyes are pretty damn good. But maybe they'll reach back out. She was very complimentary and very nice on everything I'm doing. It. I just said likewise. Once you go plant-based, over six months now, Six months and one week exactly. It's just an easy decision when you see like how much better you feel. And this isn't obviously the idea. I'm talking about the micronutrient rich eating the vegetables with all the different high protein foods that are available that I've mentioned many times. Oh, well, these are going right to my tits. I'm going to look great at the gym today. That guy's tits are huge. He must be vegan. I need another, I need another hot dog. Wait. Oh, I thought they only gave me two. I was going to use the B word. So this whole meal, three vegan glitzy dogs, chili dogs, and an order of fries, $13 and change. Poncho's might be the most fair priced vegan restaurant in, in Vegas of just giving you pure value. That vegan chili, these are superior to those wiener schnitzel dogs I had. I wonder how many of these I could eat. How many do you think I could eat? Leave a comment below. Man. All right, let's finish off those fries. Looks like a gardening business. The guy just ran up on the curb right behind me. Good thing they didn't hit my truck. Would have had to do the uh, old triple, the triple shell shock on those guys, me amigos. What a meal. Done. Oh, man. Oh, it feels good to be able to go back and train. I'm sore today, too. Oh, my upper body. <clears throat> Gotta go keep going. All right. The uh, Ponchos, Chili Dogs, and Fries Mukbang Review. I'll tell you, the one thing I would have liked to have seen 
I didn't, I, maybe next time I'll ask when I do another one of these is do a chili cheese dog review. I didn't see that on the menu, but I'm sure if you ask, they they have all the, the vegan shredded cheese with everything they use for all the, the other items. That would have really, really made that even better. Um, but with that said, I'm giving that a 9.4 out of 10 on those chili dogs. Those things... Those were good. I don't feel, I don't feel way down. I don't feel sick. You know when you sometimes eat hot dogs, like you, you see they they seem like a good idea in theory, and then you eat a, a regular hot dog, and then you're like just oh I'm sick. I know for me too. Like when I was ever whenever you're sick, the one thing that I would have to think if I thought about, it, I would throw up. If like your stomach was ill, was a hot dog, and I always wondered why that was. It's just because they're so bad for you, but not these. These aren't these. These they have the taste. But not, it, it, it's different. It doesn't have that like heavy feeling in you, that, that sick feeling. You're not eating pig asshole. That's why. I'm almost positive that's why. Um, that's why I like pig asshole, Ryan. It's delicious. Okay, Frank. Um, 9.4. And the fries are the fries. Um, they were good. They tasted like lunchroom fries. Who the hell is messaging me now? Um, I'm kidding, guys. And guys, I, I, another thing we're going to do hard to wrap up with here today. There are some people, I think they, and I know they're still watching because they, they love me, even though their comments didn't reflect that, where they like, oh, I used to, you know, you comment on everything walking by, on the people, you make fun of people. Guys, this is entertainment. Inspiration and entertainment mixed in a little bit of myself. Sometimes there's not even people walking by. So they, you're mad at me for making fun of complete nothingness. Sometimes people do walk by and I just say whatever pops in my head. Do you think I do that when I'm meeting by myself when I don't have this camera on? Do you think like, oh man, that's a hooker. Oh man, that guy's a real meth head. No, I'm not paying attention. I don't care. But it's all in the sake of entertainment. Okay. Well, no, I want to be mad about it, Ryan. That's, that's, that's your, that was your real name before, Ryback. Anyways, guys, I'm going to leave you with uh, motivate over hate. Give ourselves a chance to be great. Let you think about that one. Feed me more. Thank you guys very much for watching this Feed Me More TV episode. To check out my podcast, The Ryback Show and The Shooting Blanks Wrestling Report, please support us over at Patreon, patreon.com backslash Ryback. We have two different tiers available over there for both those shows. Feed Me More Nutrition available on feedmemore.com and Amazon. All first-time buyers can save 25% on the website with discount code SAVE25. And for all personal videos from yours truly, cameo.com backslash the big guy Ryback. Thank you guys again. Love you very much. Get hungry, stay hungry, be more, feed me more.